Primate researchers have long known that monkey infants and their mothers share an intense bond in the first few weeks of life. But what they didn't know until now is that monkey moms interact with their babies in much the same way that human moms do, with mutual gazing, loving facial gestures, and imitation. What we saw was intense face-to-face -face interactions with mothers staring into infants' faces and the infants focusing on their mother's eyes. For decades, researchers thought the attachment between infant monkeys and their mothers was based entirely on physical contact, feeding, holding, protecting. But after a study of 14 rhesus monkeys in their first two months of life, they've come to a different conclusion. The mother would hold the infant like this, with the infant looking at its mother's face and the mother uh, returning that glance and sometimes exchanging uh, facial expressions like lip smacking or sticking out one's tongue and they would imitate each other in these contexts. NIH researcher Stephen Sumi has been studying the behavior of recess monkeys for decades. We were actually very surprised to see this, uh, particularly given what the literature had, re had reported and what our own previous observations had failed to detect. Scientists have long believed that this type of intense face-to-face -face interaction was the precursor to language between human moms and babies. Because monkeys don't have language, scientists thought they didn't need the same type of emotional exchanges. And there's another factor that threw researchers off. When monkeys get older, such staring into one another monkey's eyes is a threat, and it's usually a prelude to an aggressive encounter. Here we were seeing exactly the opposite. Sumi said, interestingly, those emotional exchanges only lasted for the first three weeks of the monkey's life. At three weeks of age, these face-to-face -face interactions basically disappeared, which is probably why nobody had reported it before they were looking too late. Three weeks of age is exactly the time that these infants begin to leave their mother to start exploring their larger social world. Sumi and his team believe their findings offer new insight into the evolutionary origins of mother-infant interaction. And they say that discovery could be groundbreaking as researchers continue to search for the roots of social behavior, both in primates and in humans. A report on the study will appear in the November 17th issue of Current Biology. Kelly Daschle, The Associated Press.